What's up, YouTube? This is Yoles, and I'm here with another video on today's. And today's subject matter would be the Adidas NMD Runner and R1. So we got two. We're gonna go through um, quickly. Go through the both of the shoes, both the colorways, and maybe see what we think. All right. So for starters, let's start with the Adidas NMD Runner. So this is a shoe that is, both of these shoes, but NMD um, is a shoe that's basically made for urban lifestyle. It's not necessarily an athletic shoe, so it's really more of an um, aesthetic type of shoe for a lifestyle, more of a lifestyle, built for lifestyle, all right? So in this one, we have a black, we have the black NMD runner, and it's got the royal support block and two black supports in the midsole got like kind of it's white but kind of has a creamy feel in the midsole here we have the um, foam or boost uh, area we've got on the inside just says boost and you have some preparation so that you can actually see the sole through the the line the, sh the sock lining area of the shoe All right um, so the whole shoe it doesn't really have a tongue it just is um, kind of a, the whole thing is kind of like a sock so there's no real support structure built into the shoe right now it looks kind of uh, stable because I have the shoe tree in there but take that out you can see the whole shoe is basically um, just a sock so it's probably pretty comfortable I haven't had a chance to try it on just yet um, pretty comfortable I tried on other pair and they were comfortable um, pretty nice shoe royal white and mostly black on the upper um interestingly enough these uh blocks here 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 are part of the support structure for the shoe because it doesn't have anything in the upper which is mostly like a sock except for this mustache shaped area in the back which is kind of a heel support all right so this is a nice shoe all right and other color what we have is this grayish well it's gray for the most part it has like a black weave in it kind of weaved in with black um a mesh but it's definitely a different material than the black pair i don't know if you can see um this one had this wasn't even the one i was going for and then i saw this shoe and i got lucky enough to walk not walk i don't want to say walk in the foot locker but i waited out front of foot locker and i was i was the first one and i got the shoes that i wanted and I actually was able to pick up another pair for a friend, so got three pairs over two foot lockers. So um, this has a lot of the same. Um, it's basically the same shoe. We just have a different colorway and a different material here on the upper part of the shoe. Um, we have a black, and this is kind of a baby blue color here, or uh, just a light blue. I don't want to say baby blue, but kind of that's the best color I can think of to describe it. Um, so they have the um, laces match the um, actual upper of the shoe. You have a little bit of gray along where would be the top of the toe box, I guess. Um, stripes are in black. The mustache area in the back is black, baby blue. And this, in this, uh, I'd say the midsole is more of a cream color. Um, it's the same color as black pair. Um, overall, I really like these shoes. I liked them when I first saw them. Um, saw that they were coming out in like maybe the end of last year and maybe uh, December or November or something like that when I first saw them coming out. Then I didn't think they were going to be such a big deal because um, a lot of sometimes the things I like don't end up being like such a big deal. So I was able to grab them pretty easily. This was not the case. This felt easy yesterday, but I know I just got lucky. So. I'm really happy to be able to have gotten two pairs, actually three pairs, but myself two pairs of the NMD Runner and R1. All right.